seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have me, Sacred Stone. <laughs> oh, this you crazy mother... Now we're going to be talking about the exercises that we went to do earlier today. So yeah. earlier today we stopped by our old high school and we did a whole bunch of like training exercises, stuff that's super simple for beginners to actually look at, entry level stuff for any OCR that you're thinking of doing, may it be um, Muddy Princess to Warrior Race, all very simple. We did it specifically at the high school because it's a facility that I think a lot of people have access to. Mm. So you'll find that the stuff that we did, you'll have available to you. After a while, we just kind of got bored and improvised. That was a lot of fun. But it's just thinking of stuff to mess around and play, like it, it is a lot of fun. Even within playing, you are actually building up your muscle memory and you are actually exercising. So don't be afraid to experiment as well. Like just because you don't have access to a gym or you don't have access to an OCR course or something like that doesn't mean that you can't train. Yeah, we did a little bit of a warm up first. Yeah. A lot of the OCR stuff has, as you've seen, the upper body kind of grip, swingy kind of things. Um, so, for the beginners, I would say first just try to be able to hang on something. If just if you can't hang on something, spend 10 seconds trying to build on your grip. Because if you can't hang on your hands, mm -hmm. that's problem number one. Oh, you squeaky squeaky thing. My special weapon. His squeaky squeaky thing is also a good idea if you have one of those. So, this is something you can use in traffic, this is something you can use at home. It does go squeaky squeaky. <laughs> but just to build some strength in your forearms, um, once you can hang on your hands, then you can start working on your arms. So, we call it grip and pull strength. The one is where you can't hang, the other one is where you can hang. But that's the only thing you can do, now you can't move or you oh, can't you go can't anywhere. you can't actually pull yourself up. So, oh, Lord. work okay. on your grip first, and then, then from there start working on your upper body. Have you ever felt? Are you listening? Damn.
hamstring. And rock climbing is a really good yeah. exercise. If you find a door frame that sticks out a little bit, you can hang on the edge of it. That also builds up your hand strength and your forearm strength. And start slow and body weight oriented. For OCR, everything would be body weight oriented. Push ups, pull ups, dips, crunches, jackknives, box jumps, you know? Yeah. Don't go into the gym and take the biggest weight and look like a badass. You will break something. Yeah. Maybe you yourself and your dignity. <laughs> so don't do it. Well, folks, it's time to kick it old school. Uh, so you can feel cool. <laughs> Give it to me, baby. <laughs> baby. <laughs> yeah. You need to climb over things, you need to be able to get over a small wall or go under something. Try to keep it that way. Once you got to a level where you feel you feel comfortable with doing your stuff, then you can step it up a level. Say, take on the commando or take on the black ops, where you would start doing heavier carries and longer grip stuff. Yeah, we have uh, we have a sandbag carry. Okay. So we'll have wounded soldier, meaning you have one bag you can put it on your back, or you'll have farmers carry where you have two bags, um, or bucket carry, or sometimes you have stuff like a tire flip or. They mix it up, all the events they try and always incorporate something new. For the, the rookie and the commando courses, they all they tap down the carries, they, it's, okay. it's all catered for that level. Okay. So if you're gonna go do a rookie, they will not give you a 50 kg sandbag. Do not worry yeah. about it. <laughs> Other things that you can do to kind of exercise on this, or well, that I did, um, before I had proper weights and things, I used uh, water bottles. If you get a one litre water bottle, you can use that for weights or you can use that to practice carrying, otherwise five litre water bottles work just fine. <laughs>video later once uh, Louis starts getting into the warrior for training yes then we'll do some more explanation on exactly what training you can do what places you can go to if you want to get more specific oh.